In the nervous system, afferent neurons carry nerve impulses from receptors or sense organs toward the central nervous system. This term can also be used to describe relative connections between structures. Afferent neurons communicate with specialized interneurons. The opposite activity of directional flow is efferent. In the nervous system there is a closed loop system of sensation, decision, and reactions. This process is carried out through the activity of afferent neurons, interneurons, and efferent neurons. A touch or painful stimulus, for example, creates a sensation in the brain only after information about the stimulus travels there via afferent nerve pathways. Afferent neurons are pseudonipolar neurons that have a single long axon with a short central and a long peripheral branch. These cells do not have dendrites. They have a smooth and rounded cell body. Just outside the spinal cord, thousands of afferent neuronal cell bodies are aggregated in a swelling in the dorsal root known as the dorsal root ganglion. Afferent neuron somas are located in the peripheral nervous system and the axons of these cells travel from ganglion to ganglion and lead back to the spinal cord. The majority of these are unipolar neurons in that they have a single axon leaving the cell body and is sent towards the sensory organ. All of the axons in the dorsal root, which contains afferent nerve fibers, are used in the transduction of somatosensory information. Somatosensory receptors include senses such as pain, touch, temperature, itch, and stretch. For example, a specific muscle fiber called an intrafusal muscle fiber is a type of afferent neuron that lies parallel to the extrafusal muscle fibers thus functions as a stretch receptor by detecting muscle length. All of these sensations travel along the same general pathway towards the brain, from the dorsal root ganglion they travel to the spinal cord. From the spinal cord to the medulla, which then leads to the medial lemiscus of the midbrain. From here it travels to the primary somatosensory cortex of the parietal lobe. Etymology and mnemonics, afferent is derived from Latin participle afferentum, meaning carrying into. Add and X give an easy mnemonic device for remembering the relationship between afferent and efferent. A afferent connection arrives and an efferent connection exits. Another mnemonic device used for remembering afferent and efferent is SAME DAVE. Sensory afferent motor efferent, dorsal afferent ventral efferent. Afferent and efferent are connected to affect and affect through their common Latin roots. Afferent nerves affect the subject, whereas efferent nerves allow the subject to affect change. See also, autonomic nervous system, efferent nerve fiber, interneuron, motor neuron, references. A B C D E Carlson, Neil. Physiology of Behavior. Upper Saddle River, New Jersey, Pearson Education, Incorporated. ISBN A 9780205239333. Carlson, Neil. Carlson, Neil. A. A. B. McCullum, Don. Peripheral Nervous System. Histology and Virtual Microscopy Learning Resources. University of Michigan Medical School. Retrieved June 24, 2014 a medicalmnemonics.com 3502346337 115 external links sensory receptor neurons a dynamic list of patella convention aligned sensory neurons at neurolex